A wet night in store for all concerned. Good evening and welcome. I'm your match commentator, Derek Ray, and my partner, ready to bring you all the analysis and technical talk, is Stuart Robson. And every reason to believe we're in for an entertaining match here. It's Austria, and they take on Belgium. Thanks, Derek. Well, often we talk about the tactics, the individual players, players that are missing, but so often it's the mentality of the players that is key to winning any football game. Which of these teams has the right attitude today is the big question. And a look at the starting 11 for Austria. Marcel Zabitzer plays alongside Konrad Leimer in central midfield. And as for the attack, well, it has a bold look about it with three forwards listed from the beginning. The starting players for Belgium. Well, they're playing with a midfield diamond, so key to their success will be the holding midfielder and the player in the number 10 position. They really need to influence the game here today. And they kick off here. Lukaku, and a good challenge to bring that attack to an end. Philip Mwene. Marcel Zabitza. Intercepting it intelligently. Well, you can't watch Kevin De Bruyne and not be impressed, I think it's fair to say, Stuart. What in particular do you expect to see from him in this game? Well, it's his ability with the ball at his feet that makes him such a good player. He can go past defenders with ease, he can play in tight areas, and he has that bit of trickery as well. I'm really looking forward to seeing him play today. Using space on the opposite flank now. Gregoric. A oh, tremendous vision. And delivered into the box. Taking care of business defensively here. Lukaku. De Kate Delare. De Bruyne now. Van Aken. Excellent assessment of the situation at the back. Gregoric. He read the situation defensively and did his job. Plenty of support here. Well, this could pose problems for the defenders. Well, it nearly worked out on a fine interception. And that puts them in position. Amadou Onana. De Bruyne. Oh, good work to deny the opportunity. Kevin De Bruyne with the corner. Well, very effective goalkeeping to touch it over. Another corner.
Chance to run at them. Zabica. Can they forge ahead? No! Chance missed! And a big chance at that, Derek. He should have put them in the driving seat there. Charles de Ketelare. And Austria come away with it. Well, just one minute of time added on for stoppages here. Might go ahead. And so it is. The first half story has been written. Kevin De Bruyne, midfield organiser supreme. But is he going to be a bit disappointed with his own contribution? Well, it certainly wasn't his best half of football. He was slightly off the... And I wonder what kind of second half we have in store for us. Well, the fans really want him to shoot. It looked as though they had attacking momentum, but not so. Counter-attacking, very much an option. Carrasco. And in with a real chance. Oh, marvellous goalkeeping. Well, it's a top-class save from a top-class goalkeeper. That's absolutely brilliant. And time for the change now. And De Bruyne firing it over. Well, there's a keeper on song. Well, how did he stop that? That's just unbelievable. Not the best clearance. On a time for composure on the ball. A meaty but fair challenge, and it will be a throw-in. And into the last 30 minutes now. And Belgium in a position of menace. But they dealt with the threat posed. And over the touchline, throw for Belgium here. And they're making a change. Castagna. And he did well to cut it out. And in the perfect position to read it. Into the final 20 minutes. Lukaku. De Bruyne now. And with that, the attack fizzles out. The attack looks promising. He has time to play it over. And the keeper there to catch it under no real pressure. <laughs> Dennis Pryat. De Kate Delare. On to Castagne. Tension building still level. Giving it a try. Well, decent effort, but not troubling the keeper too much. Well, time's running out, but these fans are driving their team on here. He continues his run. Cross towards that far post. Ah, goalkeeper's ball. Not the best of crosses, really, was it? And there's the referee's whistle. These two sides cannot be separated.